So this old Cummins 12 valve has probably never been disassembled since it was installed in the truck at the factory a long time ago. And uh, I'd actually like to put this engine into a different truck. So uh, when I got the engine out, I'd like to replace the uh, crank seal, the front seal, pan gasket, and of course check on that uh, killer dowel pin. And the head gasket also I want to replace. And I was checking in my, I, I bought a, a factory service manual. It talks about using uh, or, or tightening the head bolts to a certain amount and then turning them an additional 90 degrees once that torque has been reached. So I don't want to just wing it and guess 90 degrees. So I, I actually years back bought uh, one of those angle finding gauges and that's what we're going to look at today. Not sure where I bought this thing, but I am pretty sure I didn't pay a lot of money for it. On the back side we see country of origin. So this is half inch drive and it actually works like a little a little socket extension. And this black part on the back side is actually movable from the rest of it. So if I uh you can see trying to do this with one hand guys so you can see it can slide so I'm going to put this thing to use and then uh, it'll make more sense what I'm doing with this this little rod which comes with the uh, tool is adjustable and then uh, so you can find hopefully find a place where you can make it stop up against or if you have to like maybe put a like a, a magnet or something in the way something to stop this thing from turning once you got it set and you can see there's a, so you can actually set, you can set the gauge kind of into an area that would be user friendly for you to be able to see it. So I'm going to get that set up and then I'm going to go through it. Okay, so now this head bolt is actually not tight, it's just laying in the head. So if it was tight, I would be able to nicely take the slack out of all the hardware here, like out of the socket and uh, everything, the joints here. Just put, put some light pressure on it like that. And uh, so this stop now is up against the cylinder head. And from here, I'm going to go ahead and set this dial to zero. Okay. So now I'm at zero with all the slack taken out of it and I'm going to go ahead and turn this thing 90 degrees right there. Rabbits.